what's up, Padawans, and welcome back uh, to a game I haven't really played for, for at least a good month. Back to do some more Pokemon Blue. Last time we left off, we were we were hanging out at Cerulean City. Turn down, the, turn that off. Yeah, I don't know if that's really bothering people at all, but, uh, but I don't really tend to enjoy it all that much. But, but uh, welcome to the SS Anne, or also known as the Saint Anne in apparently the anime, but whatever. Excuse me, do you have a ticket? Tom flashed the SS ticket. Great, welcome to the SSN. Cool, awesome. And then, kind of the very nice, nice graphic there. And yeah, apparently they go there. There's like a little glitch. Like if you, like if you do it like a certain way or something, you can actually go across land to the right there. But I'm not really gonna do that glitch at all. But yeah, let's see what this guy says. The passengers are are restless. You might be challenged by by the more bored ones. Well, that's kind of the reason why I'm here. Let's see what this guy. Uh, but yeah, this is probably going to be a two-parter because this because this section of the game is usually always. quite the longer one and I don't know if I'm gonna fast forward the, the battle parts or something but but yes we were hanging out at Cerulean City getting the Cascade badge and doing the Nugget Bridge Challenge and then we got to visit Bill who also got us the SS Aeon ticket And I'm not even sure why that Growlithe would even try to use Roar. It's not even really going to work all that well. Alright, one down. And got another Growlithe. Very well. Uh, hopefully you guys are having a good day so far. I'm having a pretty good day, I say. Not too bad. It's nice and nice and fairly warm for this time of year. Here in Fargo. Um, Oh, just overall life just seems to be not too shabby. And we got another trainer battle we got here. You pup, how dare you barge in? I'm trying to do that sort of accent from the anime. That guy even looks like the guy who tried to trade Ash's uh, Butterfree for... Uh... I remember what Pokemon that Ash was trying to get. Oh, it was Eradicate. Yeah, it was Eradicate. Now that I remember. You know, forgive me, my 11-year-old self had to really dig back, <laughs> dig back through the archives for that one. Uh. Humph, you rude child. And you got thirteen one thousand three hundred and thirty dollars for that. Awesome. Great. Yeah, I don't think this, yeah, this lady's not going to really 
Not really gonna say a whole much for in terms of battles. Waiter, I would like a cherry pie, please. One cherry pie to go. You know, and I even really like a waiter. Let's see what this busboy says. Bonjour, I am le waiter on the ship. I will be happy to serve you anything you please. Ah, le strong silent type. Yeah, it's kind of true. He doesn't really, he doesn't really talk so much. A cruise is so elegant yet so cozy. I always travel with Wiggly Tough. Poo up. Poo poo. -hoo. Cool. How entertaining. All right. Looks like we got about three trainers in here. I collected these Pokemon from all around the world, including Johto, Hoenn, too. Interesting. I mean, given that this was like 1996, pretty impressive. She only has like two Pokemon. Come on, she can try a little harder than that. I mean, if she caught. I mean, if she caught a Pichu. I'd be definitely, definitely very impressed. Yeah, I think I'll just keep Butterfree in just for this one so that I can actually get some experience out of it. And then have Nidoran, the female, meet its male counterpart, its male second stage, and just absolutely destroy it. Got an orient attack. Oh, so close. Yeah, let's just use a tackle on that. See, I'm always glad. I'm always glad when something works out like that. It just warms my heart. I went all around the world for these. Well, you didn't really try all that hard, now did you? Yeah, I can. I, I thought so. All right, number two. I love Pokemon. Do you? Well, there's kind of. I guess there's a reason why. I'm playing this game is to play Pokemon and win the game. And the youngster sent out Nidoran. Very well. Uh, shall I use Gust? Critical hit. Cool. And destroyed the youngster. Wow, you're great. $315 for that. Whatever. How lame. I found TM to uh, zero eight. Awesome. We are cruising around the world. Okay, you're not going to fight me. I don't think this guy is going to... Shh, I'm a global police agent. I'm on the trail of Team Rocket. You know, good luck with that, bud. I wish you all the best in the world. And we can go ahead and go over to the Pokemon Center. Yeah, that's where I want to go. And let's head back over there. And yes, I yes, I show my tickets. Kind of an annoying part. Having to show the guy your ticket, even though you already showed it already. Uh, let's see what's over here. Let's see here. 
Our captain is a sword master. He even teaches cut to Pokemon. Awesome. That's exactly what I need. And we're at the... Uh, I think it's the stern. Yeah, because the bow is the back of it, right? Anyway, ahoy there. Are you seasick? Not yet. I haven't spewed out anything relatively yet. All right, sent out mock chop. Should be pretty easy fight. Except for that critical hit, and critical hit. What a doozy. That time it wasn't that lucky, but. Yeah, that's not that cool. Definitely agree that uh, Sprite is definitely very, very, very entertaining. And I am now confused. Oh, great. And I hurt myself. Yeah, through acid. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. You gotta be kidding me. All right, hopefully. Really? Oh my god. What a darn shame. That's, that's the reason why I hate Confuse so much. Like, there's... Like, I don't even know what the odds are for... Like, the chances are of you actually getting a hit off of something and I don't have it arrive, revive. What lame this is this. No, oh, don't want to go there. How lame. But I'll have to, once I record this video, I should probably check and see if, whether if the music interferes with my voice at all. And if it does, then I'll just, well, keep it, keep it <laughs> muted. For as pretty much as long as possible. And if it doesn't really do anything with it, I might just uh, I just might just put it back in there. But we'll see. Yeah, here's a kitchen. I don't see, I don't see anything in here. Oh, there's something in here in this area. Yep, there's a great ball. Awesome. Got some food on the table. I don't even think the cooks really offer that much anything to you. So I'll just keep on moving. Hey, mighty, let's uh, do a little jig. I don't even really know what a jig is, but, but if he wants a fight, then he has a fight. Got another mech chop. Or is it Ma Chop? Yeah, I'll just yeah, I'll just say that's Ma Chop. to that attack pretty much it doesn't really affect me but it 
does affect his defense quite a bit, which which pretty much means that the attacks that I do actually hit on him, in this case not really, but does increase his defense against my attacks. But in that case, it was a critical hit, and it, well, didn't really work out so well for that shell there. You're impressive. Uh, 540 dollars for that. Oh, great. Let's see, scrubbing decks is hard work. Let's see, yeah, this is Earth. I feel ill. I stepped out to get some air. Let's see what else this guy say. The party's over. The ship will be departing soon. Hmm. Must be one hell of a party. Let's, let's go see what's inside these rooms here. In all my travels, I've never seen any Pokemon sleep like this one. It was something like this. And that is a Snorlax. Yeah. And that's basically the reason why I'm not going to be able to get anywhere south of here so that's kind of the reason why i have to go back north once i take care of business in this city check out what i finished up oh with gratitude especially if it's fish my ivysaur will gladly will gladly take a look at your pokemon there for you bud and nice good old vine whip. Aw, didn't actually, you know, didn't actually do the whole thing. This game is rigged. <laughs> All right, so it's kind of cool. Let's see how good this vine whip does against it and it doesn't really do much okay yeah well his attack's not really that effective either so i i guess it works out yeah if it's if it's acid that really is its only attack then i'm Pretty much gonna win that battle very, very easily. And no, I'm not gonna really change. Change out Pokemon and see if Vine Whip does the trick on this other Golding. And it does not. No, oh, what the hell? Yeah, I missed that attack. Missed what attack it was that was actually super effective. Yeah, one darn shame. And defeated fisherman. I'm all out. 